Okay, we're now on the, we've moved farther north. We're on the western side of the old Hedekin Sale, very close to the village of Garrettstown here to my right. We're looking at, again, the bedrock here, which is composed of sedimentary rocks. The rocks that we see here are mostly siltstones and some fine-grained sandstones. They were laid down in a marine environment, again during the Carboniferous. They're actually the youngest rocks that we see uh, on the old head of Kinsale. They're upper uh, Carboniferous in age. And I, the interesting thing I want to show you here is uh, we have a lovely example of folding uh, related to the Variscan mountain building event that occurred at the end of the Carboniferous. So these original layers, sedimentary layers of, as I say, mostly siltstone, they were laid down in a marine environment. Uh, the belief is they were laid down by undersea currents, turbidity currents. At the end of the Carboniferous we had compression from the south and we folded these layers. And that folding operated on a wide range of scales. You might argue that the, the peninsulas that we see down in southwest Ireland are Variscan Falls in themselves. And here we're, we have a meter scale example of these falls. The falls are aligned east-west. Compression was from the south. In addition, we can see that these rocks are highly fractured. Uh, again, that is what you'd expect to see when you're deforming uh, uh, the, these, these sedimentary rocks during the mountain building event. And in addition, we see a fabric, and we can see that here uh, on this surface here. We see a tectonic fabric. We call that a, a cleavage fabric. Um, and that basically was imparted into the rock uh, during that squeezing event. It's a, if you like, it's a tectonic grain produced by stress uh, applied to the pile of sedimentary rock during the mountain building process.